Okay, I have a uh, couple more locks uh, from West Coast Picks. Um, this one he has been in two has probably got the one or more uh, chambers threaded all the way down. This one doesn't appear that he has uh, opened up the Bible, but we know there's probably something different in the inside here. So uh, this lock does work, bidding on the key. Let's lay that one to the side. Let's do this easy one first, the one that's uh, had threading in it. That makes it easier to pick. Okay, the key does work. It's got a little hang in it every once in a while. But now if we turn the, this upside down, it's got more of a hang. So that means it's got a very weak spring on one chamber. So let's go ahead and open this easy one first today. And then uh, the next one we'll open the hard one. Get it put in the vise. This is uh, marked as a uh, arrow on the key itself, but this is a slag uh, keyway, so we're gonna call this a arrow slag. Okay, well let's open the easy one, and then we'll get to the hard one on our next video. See if we can get this uh, dialed in a little bit closer. Okay, I'm going to use top of the keyway, this little tension wrench. I don't know what kind of pick this is going to take, but I believe this one will work. Uh, I had another one and uh, misplaced it, so let's just see if we can work our way to the back of the lock. Okay, there's a little bit on six and five. There's some on three, two. Okay, let's go to the back. Okay, we touched uh, pin four and uh, give us a good turn on the plug. There was a little bit more on five. Some more on two. There's a little bit more on three. Just touching the thing as we go to the back and gives a little bit more of a turn on the plug. Okay, there's a little bit more on pin one. Now let's let's change picks. We're gonna get a little bit skinnier pick now. Okay, we're missing a pin somewhere. There it is. It's pin one that was uh, hanging up on us. So let's go ahead and gut this one. See what kind of pins are in it. I have found um, through uh, picking these locks, most of these locks are easier to pick if they've been threaded. Some are not, but most of them are. Let's get the clip off. That's come off fairly easy. All right. Let's see if we can um, do this without uh, messing up on the. Um, I think we're gonna have to try to shim it. See if we can run a shim in it. There we go. I had to have the uh, thing upside down. We got uh, one pin 
hung up so we had to straighten these uh, key pins out I turned it up too much but let's go ahead and pull the upper pins out then we will uh, check the uh, bottom pins let's get this number one pin out while we're here okay that's one okay I think he's got some uh, pin and pin in this lock may not be yeah there's a part of it Slip. There we go. All right, that one just popped out. Okay, that's another pin and pin, and he does have. Uh, threading in the uh, chambers. I'm not really too interested in how many. Let's go ahead and get the uh, pins here separated then we will take a closer look at them. Okay, let's look at the plug. Okay, he has all six chambers threaded. Uh, even got some little notches, uh, or a little notch on this uh, number one for some reason, probably just a defect in the plug. Okay, let's take a close look at the pins. But if you really want to make a good challenge lock, you need to get one with good tolerances and. Um, not, don't worry about threading. Okay, the first three pins on the bottom of the key pins are serrated. This one got a weird looking serration on it, but it's serrated. This is another type of, uh, okay, this is not, uh, is this a key? Yeah, that's a pin and pin also. So, I think that's a pin and pin. Maybe not. If it is, it's uh, wedged in there. So, anyway, that's the way it came out. This is a pin and pin. It's serrated. Another pin and pin. It's serrated. Okay. This is uh, another uh, pin and pin spool. This is just a regular homemade spool with a serration on it. This is another pin and pin, serrated. You can put some serrations on the uh, inside of the uh, pins. Okay, that was the hard lock. I mean the easy lock. So the next one we'll have to do will be the hard one. So. Alright West Coast Picks, I appreciate this uh, these locks, thank you very much. Please stay out of trouble, please do not do anything illegal, and thank you again.